Hi de ho, ha ha ha. Hello, my babies. Come here. I'll, I don't. I'm not gonna get you sick. Just don't breathe. Don't breathe on me. I won't be on you. I just got back from the doctor. Uh, sorry, guys. They're gonna give me my puto uh, antibiotic and all the refills that I needed. Mija, ¿cómo se llama Tanya? Tanya. Tanya se llama Tanya. 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 What? Tanya. Who's Tanya? From, 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 from my, my Luto. Spider-Man? ¿Cómo? Who's Spider-Man? Who's Spider-Man? Ahorita te metes, por favor. Maybe I'm mistaken. It's because I'm not feeling well. You know? La Julia me hizo ahorita rápido una... It's a wannabe meatball soup. She just put all this stuff in there that we had in the fridge, like... The other day when she made me potatoes with cheese and everything. So it has veggies. And then she put in a uh, a can of mixed veggies. And then I had the last two tor tor tacos. Ya no hay tacos. Okay. These were fucking bomb, guys. Fíjate que <clears throat> yesterday I didn't think I was going to be able to talk and make it through the video. And mira, I did. Amen. I love talking to you guys. Let me see. I'm going to think. No good. I think. I'm almost 100% sure that everything I say is, is true. Because I don't like to lie, you know. Mm. Oh, guys. Let me tell you what happened to me right now in the morning. Okay. Because I can't drive no more because of my eye, right? But this one is. 20 training is perfect. It's so perfect that eyelash keeps falling off. I get feel, oh, I hate it. This eye looks smaller today. Maybe because I'm sick. Yeah. Maybe because I'm sick. This one looks little. Huh? That's the eyelash itself. It's an eyelash. Huh? That's all. Stupid. Bueno. Y luego me las pinte blue. Bueno. You know how I'm poor. So... And I'm disabled, so I'm allowed to ride those little buses or vans that take you and from to and from your doctor's appointments or whatever, right? Okay. Well, this morning, this guy came and I looked at him and I didn't recognize him. He was on another bus. It's called Viva. Viva bus or Viva transportation. Viva bus. Julia says that we've been on it before. But anyways. I look like a good looking guy. So I roll my ass down over here till I get to the little ramp that is like for handicap. One, two, it's like two apartments down. And then I was coming already like like this. But there's a big spot of oil so I always go around it. And then yeah, he finished pushing me. And Julia was still inside the house. So trip out on this okay guys um he got me and he pushed me up okay but um look let me show you this is my outfit for the day just the little pant shorts that we got for like a dollar or less and then my little pink shoes dudes this guy pushes me up right and he had already put the ramp down Puts me up on it and is holding behind me while pressing the button that make it go, you know. And he starts doing this. And and then Julia was finally coming and then I noticed that he stopped, but he went like that, like. Humping my chair, okay? That's what I'm going to call it, humping my chair. And I was... So, I didn't know what to do. I froze, and I just went like that and looked at the floor, and then when Julia got in, I wanted to tell her, but I didn't know if this vato understands English, but he looks more Mexican-y. 
So I try to tell her like in codes that this man did that to me. Then Jota tells me, I know him, man, he's just brilliant. Trying to get you on, you know, and I was like, mm. No, because you know, even as an old person, when you're way older, you know what a good touch is and a bad touch is, right? <coughs> and then we started going to my apartment. And this dude keeps looking at me through the rear view mirror. And I just turned around because I felt bad. And then one of the times I turn around, look at my one like that to him, and then I told him, "It is bien pelado, with that. Like you're you're real nasty, huh?" And he told me, "No, why?" I said, "Why were you going like this to me?" He didn't even answer me. He could have said, "No, man, you're wrong," or "Or I'm sorry, I didn't mean for you to take that way," or "I was just securing you." Whatever. He didn't say nothing, guys. He didn't say nothing. Mm -hmm. Because I'm sick <clears throat> and mocos and coughing and phlegm and my eyes are watering so they were watering so I'm, I kept going like this so I'm sure he thought that I was crying. And then I told him in Spanish, you shouldn't, you shouldn't do that. And he didn't say nothing more. And then, but I did ask him, like, what time do you get up? And he said, at three. And I said, I hope, I, in my mind, I hope I'm, I get out of the doctor after three, right? Hmm. All right, that's why I tell you guys. Everything that you go through, emotions or whatever, everything affects you like a motherfucker. Guys, I got there and I drank a little coffee because they always have a coffee machine, right? And then, when it was my turn to go get my vitals, meh, I lost one pound, 219. Okay, so... The, the new guy that was taking care of me, because I've never seen him. He, oh, you're new, hi. And then he's like, no, I've been here for I don't know how many years. What? Que salsa? Already? Because it's hot. In here, huh? Tíralo la verga. Wow. Check the other one. And, and if not, put it in the fridge. Or give me some so I can put it in my soup. No, but I can't smell, so I don't know if it's good or bad. The, the queso salsa? Oh, it has mold, she says. Okay, because I have put it in the fridge and then we can oh, this is out. good still. I'm going to put some in my... In my car. Toma, mete esta en la galera. Por favor, gracias, mira. So, when Julia pushed me in there, Julia said, let me go to the restroom real quick. And I said, yeah. And I was still stupid. And then... Um, the little boy tells me that my blood pressure is low. And I said, real low? And he said, a little. I said, what made it go down? Maybe because I drank a little bit of coffee? And he said, no, that would actually bring it up. And I was still quiet. And then I told him, maybe, you know what happened to me, mijo? I told him, this dude doesn't matter. It's because I felt weird, you know? I told me he goes to a lot of people like that take advantage. Well, because I'm disabled, because I'm in a wheelchair, whatever. But when he said that, I start feeling more bad, right? Yeah, Julia comes and gets me, and I go over there and we sit down. Well, what up? A very nice lady that sat behind me. In fact, in my wheelchair, it says Chula. And she goes, Chula, que es la Chula? And I said, yo, yo me creo muy guapa. Que bueno, mija, que bueno. 
I'm just gonna go get a cup of water because they have the water and the coffee in the back. Always. This family came in. A girl, her daughter, about 15, and a set of twins, boy and girl, like 12 maybe. But I feel so bad because when I passed by, when I was going to get my water, I could hear the lady going, uh, you know, and I could paint. No. Oh. Norma, si me estás viendo, esa chavita que te digo, se parecía igualita, igualita Valeria, igualita. De bonito cuerpo, toda su cara y todo. Me dio que dice que, me dio que dice, ¿qué tienes, mija? Es que me duele todo. Me dice, oh, my God. Pues, en mi purse, I have, um, Julia likes to buy those uh, mints, icebreakers, ¿eh? Mm, I said, ¿Quieres una menta, mi cabecita, Viviana? Sí, por favor. So I, I got it out and I told her, and I told her, get some for you, baby, so it's little mints, you know? I mm, I tell her, the real boy look like a girl because he had long hair. But at the same time, he had a face like a little boy, right? I, I didn't want to embarrass him or, or offend him. So I said, what's your name? Jay, Jason or Jaden or something like that. And I said, you're so cute. Look at that hair. Yeah. Ya no me sentí mal. Ya poco son twins. Yeah, son mis cuates. But she was all out of it, pobrecita. Anyways, I came back over here and the lady told me, chula. We just started talking. I talk to everybody, me vale verga. I don't care how they look or how they dress or whatever. I'm not like that at all. Um, so, I started talking to a lady. I think, I think, Julia's going to be like this, but. I think God sent her like a little angel to calm me down from what happened. Because I was shook up, you know? I, I, that shit don't go with me, man. You know, because I have big boobs doesn't mean that I want to with everybody. And that's what they all think. Guys, they just opened up the dating app today on Facebook. Woo! Time to have fun. But anyway. Um... This is my coffee from the morning. In the morning, Julia put me like four taquitos, but I only ate two. Because I just need a little something in my stomach, so I was still feeling a little bad and shit. Um, my lady was talking and talking and talking. And she kept telling me, Telling Julia that she was so pretty and so beautiful, and we were talking about um, thyroid and diabetes and about this and that. Really nice lady. Así como Raquelito hace me figuro. Just a really nice, kind lady, sweet lady. Maybe in her 68, 69 play. And she had two little French braids like that. With canas like me. This is all canas. Gray hair? This is gray hair. And so. In the end. I saw her about it too. And in my mind I felt like. Ay, en mi cachos no se aire, no andes platicando tus cosas. But no, I just felt that I had to because I, I didn't feel right. And she goes, report him. And I said, well, I don't want them to feel like, like, ay, she's already an old lady and she getting, um, acá se está aguitando porque le hacen así, pero, 
I told her, I said, it's because I don't want them to move that high. It's probably a high enough. And she was like, imagine what it does to the other people that are like paralyzed and they don't move at all or something. And I said, yeah, huh? Nah, that bitchy little fucker can not pick this up. But when he was going to get me on, when we were at the doctor's and he was going to get me on the car, he, back as he te dijo, Julia, ya te puedes ir para allá or something. What did he say? Ya te puedes meter or something. Huh? He don't want her standing there. He's a puto. He don't want her standing there. That's why I kept on you. Julia, you. I know what a good touch is and a bad touch is or what they mean by what they do, the way they brush up against you or whatever. Mm, I'm silly and everything you want and and cause and everything, but I don't like being touched if I'm not in agreement with it. You know what I mean? I don't know. I feel like molesting, you know, like if I was a kid and molesting me. La verdad. I did. So when, when we got out, Julia came and ran inside to get him a bottle of water because we always do that for our drivers. And it was her head. And when she opened the door, my dogs came out. They're both pugs, right? He goes, Ay, ay, guapo. Son dos perritos. And he said, Si. Sí. And then he was telling us that yesterday his pug died. And his name was Max. And we said, His name is Max, too. Oh, well, so he started talking to us. Ya limo su agua y se fue. And he told me he was married and that he was 38 because I asked him. But, um, Julia's like, you feel better now? And I said, a little bit, but he, he still shouldn't have done that. And Julia's like, Mom, he's, because I told him, Mira, ya ves que me estás haciendo otra vez. I go, No, es mi rodilla, señora. Es que no quiero que se caiga para atrás. So, yeah, I did feel like. The same feeling that I felt before. But I thought he was going like this with a heart on, you know. But. <clears throat> two, how come he didn't say, No, señora, no lo tome mal, o disculpeme si la He didn't say nothing. Or let me say it in English. He didn't say, I'm sorry if I offended you, or if you think I disrespected you, or, or, or but no, I didn't. I, I was just trying to secure you. Or whatever. Mm. That's why I always get sick from my stomach. Uh, I've always, since I was little, mixed everything, you know. This is a, a little pouch that we had bought from Family Dollar when it was closing down. It was a little pouch with meatballs and spaghetti, right? And then her potatoes from the other day. And then I kind of mix vegetables. And then the cheese that I poured on right now. But um, again, they already gave me a pill that helps me not get sick from my stomach. <sighs> I wonder where that guy wrote to me all of a sudden. I have a friend that texted me all of a sudden. When I, he had told me if I was in my chance and all I was, but he's very sick, very sick. I'm, I don't want to tell you what it, what he has, but hmm. I lost my husband. And this is a heart attack. Then the next serious relationship I had was with a friend, and he died of cirrhosis. But we weren't together anymore. We were we had been apart for like a year, but I still loved him to death, and he loved me. Um. After that, I was like, I know. 
That is stupid. And um, well, it's really sad, guys, when you when you are a widow and then you try to give somebody else a chance and it happens again. They pass away on you. No matter if just because I'm 54, I mean, even if when you're younger, you know, people pass away at all ages. I tell you, it feels like it's going to pop, but it doesn't pop. So you're left there with the feeling, you know. Pop! Let pussy pop, pop, pop. Let pussy baby pop, 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 pop. Okay? That's a song from that old movie from the 80s, maybe 90s, Major Pain. Huh? It's fucking funny. Anyways, yeah, I gotta get over it, but I'm glad I'm telling you guys too. And you guys too, if you guys ever go through something similar, don't stay quiet. Say something. Like they say in my videos. And, and, and Facebook that I follow. Wait, is that on Facebook or is it on... No, it's on YouTube. It's called Misery Machine. And they talk about cases and cases of stuff. Mostly it's about... Um, child abuse. Mostly. And he always says... Remember what we always say. If you see something, say something. Ay, you're all dirty. Más sucios que la chingada. Can you hear me go? <clears throat> Como se me hace guapo ese negro. Perdón, ese moreno. Sorry, guys, I didn't mean to say that. The black man is so handsome. African American. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Tans what did you say? Tony. What's that? I think. He's the one from. Why did I get married? Why did I get married? But he looks exactly like that. Is he also the one no, from. He's not. he's not. His name is Richard T. Jones. Richard T. Jones guy. From the movie, Why Did I Get Married? Ay, se me hace bien guapo. En, esta mo en este show de Rookie. Está bien chulo. He's, he's hot. He's very handsome. Ay, wey. But there's one named... You know what? And Julie was like, China. do you want me to put the meatballs in there? What? There's one named China. On oh, China? Her name is China. Ah, cabrón. Like Chinita. ¿A qué hora le salió una china? No. Hay uno que se llama Enciso, pero no sé si es hombre o mujer. Se me hace que es hombre. China. She's commented before. She wants to shout out. Shout out to China. Where is she from? Does it say? Ay, shout out to you, China. Claro que sí les hago shout out. Yeah, guys, when you want me to shout you out, Mandy, Rashida, Ashley. Mm-hmm, Rashida. What's up, girl? Ashley. There's a Tanya in there. You probably, it's probably Tabulan. Tabulan is Ashley. No. Yeah. But there's another there's no one. Mm -mm. Jessica Flores. Mandy. Jessica Flores. Shout out. ¿Qué más, mami? Mandy. Mandy, my Mandy Chula. Uh, Geek Vander. Geek band or something. I think it's a vato. Yeah. Shout out to you, Geek. In Texas, 218. In Texas? Yeah, but there's no Tonya. Somebody's called in Texas? All right, Texas. I'm from Texas, too. How you doing? Listen to it. Ooh. No, 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 no. No, I'm just Oh, no, 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 no. Mm -hmm. Oh, who's calling me 915? 
Oh, I'm busy with that guy. Ow, 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 ow. Ah! Está bien, ow. Estaba bien atorado en triste pelo. Guys, de por sí que nomás tengo tres pelos. Es de Texas. Hablando de Texas. People associate Texas people. <coughs> yeah, we like to eat steak and we do. I do. <laughs> este, ¿qué voy a decir? I'm sorry, guys. That's why they want to go out. Because I sound like a dog. Like a dying dog. See, sí, con steak y la chingada. Home of the steak. Got a lot of steakhouses here in Texas. A lot of steakhouses. Oh, my God. I wasn't going to tell you guys. Stupid cough that interrupted me. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say, I love meatballs, but these are not like 100% beef. They put a lot of additives and and stuff in there that just to keep it, you know, bien que no se haga malo. Okay, I want my. They have a big bag of meatballs. And then the other one is called sausage flavor. Italian style. And I love them, but I get, I can't even see you guys. I get really sick in the night and of heartburn with all them spices here. I said, what do you mean? What do you mean? What is it? What's his name? Do you know? The actor in there. Mm -hmm. hmm? um, Is he a detective? Probably, huh? Mm -hmm. There's this hot guy on this show that Julia watches. He goes undercover with that chinita. Next he goes time. undercover with the chinita. Because they found two criminals that look exactly like them, so they're going undercover. As no, Bahamas. That's funny. Mm -hmm. She says that they found two criminals that looked exactly like them. I know. Tag team back again. His name is Eric Winter. Eric Winter in the show or his real name? His real name. He's married to... What's his name in, in the show? Tim. Tim. Are we guys watch Rookie? Isn't this a brand new show to that? Um, since 2018 and they're still... 2018? Okay. There's a bunch of hot, hot, hot men in here. I'm beautiful. I don't know woman. if you remember, but the one from Rush Hour, he's married to her. The one of that, that gets like. I don't know if you remember Rush Hour. She looks a little bit like. Rush Hour? Yeah, she looks a little bit like. To me, she's like a mix of. Oh, right here? She looks like Sandra Bullock and Kate Del Castillo. Oh, yeah. Like a mix. Yeah, Miss Rush. She, she's right. He, she looks like Kate Del Castillo and Sandra Bullock. Bullock. But I don't know if mixed. you remember her from the. When, uh, when when he's like, I love Snoopy, when she's taking her clothes off. Oh, is that her? Yeah. Oh, that beautiful Mexican, yeah. She's taking off her clothes and then checking to like, I love Snoopy. Yeah. And then, este, ¿cómo se llama? Chris Tucker, I think, okay. What's Snoopy? Let me see. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> They're all fighting to see the, her ass. It's because she has a tattoo that, it, it does look like a Snoopy, huh? <clears throat> Only because I don't, I didn't throw this soup together or else I would have even put noodles, ramen noodles. But it's nice and warm and I know it's going to do me good.
turn off this um what are you doing in the 30 minutes or 39 minutes? I think 30 minutes. <coughs> mm -hmm. So the meatballs? They don't taste Mexican in like albondica soup. They taste gabachos, you know? That's like, um, not to offend anybody, okay? Mm. But it's just like, um, mm. Taco Bell does not taste like, go to a taquito truck and, and, and get two taquitos with cilantro and cebolla and then men and uh, chile. Yes. They don't taste like, but they're both tacos, you know? It's like Tex-Mex. Tex-Mex. Well, no, not Tex-Mex, is it? Mm. I, I hate Tex-Mex. They put corn in everything. Like the Southwest salad, I don't like that. Southwest salad has corn in it. Uh, Santa Fe. Didn't they call Santa Fe salad? I think they call both. Probably. I like the ones with corn. When I was pregnant, Jesse, guys, my, my husband always worked at Wendy's. There was a salad that was like four or five bucks. I'm not lying. There was a time that I was craving that salad so much and my husband was bringing me home like what? Every day, yeah. Granted, he gave it at half price, but it's still. Um. Some of this ain't my chocolate. Not me. I can't smell anything. What is it? Chocolate like for cookies? Yeah. Like those baby chocolate chips. Oh. I can't smell. It has yellow. Yellow? No, it's is just that the peanut color. Butter? No, it's just the color of the oh. packaging. Show it to me. Yeah, she bought this. This is still from freaking Family Dollar. Can't even taste them. Put it away. Yeah, it tastes taste just like it. wax. Bland. Yeah, it tastes like wax. You know, mm. you know like when you get cheap chocolate and it's like waxy and like Mother Grosso, like you feel mm -hmm. like... I'm gonna let you guys go so I could do a shout it. Show it to me, show it to me. Ooh, guys. Okay. Take care of yourselves because the rest video is going around really bad. It's cold. <laughs> Just kidding. Yes, I'm kidding. Yes, I'm kidding. Okay, bye bye, guys. Take care. Much love and respect to everyone out there. Shout it out.